don't know. We've been fishing for a little while. Simon just got one there now. Shane and myself. And uh, well, we've got a couple of nice ones in the lab. Well, uh, one was a lab, but it's not doing too good now. Um, Bananas. Uh, yeah, nah, that one's dinner, I reckon. Um, but those two are doing okay. So we'll try and get a few more. It's beautiful up here. Weather's nice. Weather's beautiful. Well, it's a bit of a mission. The lake is really shallow. Uh, so we had to do a river launch uh, from where the cows drink water um, and try and avoid standing in cow poop. Uh, it's fishing, that's the way it is. Um, and uh, we've sounded up some fish in this area here. We're just going to hope they come on the bait. There's been a few small ones, but uh, hang on. We just talk as we're talking here. There might be a live hook up, maybe. Let's see what happens. Oh, yeah. yeah, he's on. Nothing exciting. I don't know about that. Yeah, we'll see what happens. It's always exciting catching fish. Doesn't matter whether it's big or small. Uh, no, turning, well, turning a re uh, bad day of fishing is better than a good day of work. Is what they say, I think. Uh, he's uh, he's going for a bit of a walk, isn't he? He's going for a walkabout. All right. He's feeling athletic, this fish. Pretty good. Easy, easy, boy. If he wants to run, let him run. Oh yeah, it is a good fish. Got it. Right? Yes. Yes. <laughs> and uh, that would be a decent fish. It's in the 30s. I reckon definitely over 30s. Maybe 31, 32. But that's a good fish. I'll get Simon to just. Uh, But this is just going to put up again. A bit of 
Bushman's goes a long way up here. So what I'm actually doing is I'm trimming, trimming the prawn down. Just a tasty bite-sized piece of there. First bait in the water, a little black brim. Look how nice colors in it. Beautiful colors. It's only a little one, but we'll aim for the bigger ones. We got Robson out there, and he's giving it a good crack. So we'll see how we go. It's a healthy little system. And I got him this time. Hey, we're back out here on the river. Team get drilled again. 28 fish yesterday. Woo! Uh, this is uh, where we are. And no one caught 26. <laughs> and uh, literally first bait in the water. One keeper in there, and she's good. He's quite happy to stay over there for now. And uh, just set up this. That didn't take long. Mind the GoPro uh, set up. It's a bit shit. It's a shit. Oh, that's a nice fish. Sorry. Oh. Yeah, Clean up a little bit. Really light gear, guys. We're looking at uh, there's a little snag there. Oh, there's a, oh, another keeper, I reckon. 30. Probably 30. Beautiful. Simon never misses on the net, tell you all that much. Okay, no. If you don't like swearing, don't watch my videos. <laughs> I swear a lot. We are down in Louisiana at the moment. Mm -hmm. the come back, that's Keeper, that's about 30 some odd. He's gonna go in the live well. Oh. 
All right, let's do it again. And uh, that didn't take long. This might be the third fish in the well. Anytime now, my compadres might join me. The heat is, uh, the heat is hot. <laughs> it is on. Oh, I lost him. I lost him. Delete. Delete, delete. delete. Abort, abort cut. mission. Cut. As we would say normally. You don't lose this one. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, at the moment, we're making blooper videos. This one doesn't feel as big as the other one. But that's because it's too into it. What the hell? It's suicide fish. Suicide beam. That's another beautiful paper. It's another 30. Oh, close, 29. Kind of keeper, we'll put him in the live well. We'll upgrade. Later. Oh, settle down, boys. You all get used to each other. The food you all come the same place. We got on the end, Aldi. <laughs> Mud crab! I got myself a mud crab. My glasses get fogged up. Ooh. Sweating like a black man on fucking vape charges. <laughs> get set, that is huh? Oh yeah, that's because I didn't drop my plastic But actually, You should have asked earlier. Oh, this a better fish. Use the rod, guys. Use the rod. Whoa. Yeah, that's not working. <laughs> I'm angry with the bug of this one. Hooked in the corner of the lip. And five in the live well. Oh, it would be a 30. Look at that, look at that sort of Gippsland swim. Better looking than some of the people up here. Look at that. Ah, beautiful fish. Beautiful. Big blue lips. Never thought I'd say that. I like blue lips. Alright. Uh, back to bring you a weather update. The rains are coming, Paul. Uh, <laughs> rains, <laughs> winds. Lightning, thunder, it's all coming. Um, that's what it looks like. Two minutes. Oh, oh, did you see that? Wait for that. It's Armageddon, and it's coming from that way. Um, I think the worst is in front of us, really. Yeah. Um, it's going to be close. But we decided instead of making a run for it, we're just gonna button down the hatches and stay put. And hopefully the log that we tied up to holds in place. <laughs> we'll soon find out. Uh, we'll keep you all posted. Real time fishing adventures right here. Yeah. <laughs> Open it! Finally, just giving the boat a bit of a clean before heading off. I'm just gonna put you all down there.
boat's all cleaned up. Boys are still packing. It's been a good trip. We struggled in the beginning, but we kind of figured out what the fish were doing and then we did pretty good. Um, obviously, just when we figured that out, the weather started to turn to shit. Um, but we still persevered and we got a oh, fair, oh, we got a few fish. Um, and uh, yeah, so that's a Bem River trip. Um, hopefully I'll bring bringing you on a bit more footage from uh, different places. If you want to stay tuned, uh, could be East Gippsland, Melbourne, wherever. And um, yeah, it's not just about the fishing, it's more about the adventure. Some of the places we go to, really remote, hard to get to, uh, hence the chainsaw in the car. Um, and uh, yeah, more adventures coming soon. See ya.